All right, here we go. Um, so this is this is my village. Uh, I, don't, I don't have a name for it. I don't really know if I care enough, but we'll just start uh, here. The graveyard. Where where all good things uh, begin. Um, there's no gravekeeper. Um, what are they called? I can't think. What is it? A uh, morgueman? A, a mortgage? There's no mortgages. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, we'll just go over here. Um, this is. I like to call it a uh, courier court. Uh, cause yes, yeah, where my couriers live right now. Uh, you, uh, believe it or not, there is a warehouse right next to it. Um, and, uh, believe it or not, I just figured out that there's room down here for, uh, courier houses. Uh, don't, just, um, just ignore the fact that, uh, yeah, I, I'm an idiot. We'll head back here to where our archer, one of our archers live. Um... Yep, you just go up here, and then look at that. Ooh, oh, fuck. Rip. Okay. Here is the first builder, builder's hut. Like a palace at this point. Um, so there's this weird thing that happened, kept happening, where, um, like a wandering trader would just stand right here, and then you'd have this stupid llama that's just standing right here, and actually got one of my uh, builders killed because of it. Which sounds completely insane but it is what happened like they just kept pushing him off and he kept taking damage and then he died <laughs> I like that one too and yeah, here's the inside level 5 by the way um, let's see just head over here to the house that I built initially for the builder but now the doctor lives here and I guess the crusher no one cares about the crusher. And everyone's going to bed tonight. Here is the hospital. It's got two beds. And kelp. Oh shoot, honey. I got honey. Show that off in a bit. Uh, this is the, one of the more recent ones. It's the crusher. Uh, excuse me. I, th I thought it looked cool. Because uh, it had like a very slope structure. Um... I'm, I'm gonna fix it later, I promise. It'll look good when it's d when I'm done with it, alright? So this is the town hall. It looks pretty epic, uh, if I say so myself. I didn't build it, but I had someone build it for me. Because I'm a capitalist, and I don't do anything about it for myself. But yeah, and then you just come up to the top, and you look down, and you're like, can't see shit. So that's the restaurant over there more residents behind it. Where the, I'll show it off right now. Actually, yeah, I'll do it right now. Why not? Yeah, here's the, um, there's a jail here. I wanted to put a pillager in here because they piss me off. <laughs> they do. They're, they're probably like the number one cause of death and I don't know how to stop it. Um, oh yeah, here is the blacksmiths. There's a pickaxe missing. Okay. Strange. Uh, and then here is. Yeah, it's directly connected. Because I thought it'd be cool. Um, another residence. Uh, a couple people died uh, making this. A couple people died. Okay, this is bad luck. Yeah, it's, it comes out right at the town hall. Jeez. In case you don't have spatial awareness. Um, there's the original. The tavern right here looks pretty cool. Functions pretty well. Uh, like five, like three or four builders died making this uh, the first version of this because they just kept destroying the torches. <laughs> it was it was a very painful experience, I'll say. Um, yeah, just ignore that. That happens every single night. Uh, here's a guard tower. I forget. Are you an art? You're a knight. Okay. I don't upgrade these because I just forget. It's like iron, that's good enough. Even though, like, diamond would be infinitely better. Um, 
here's the second builder's hut, the one that I built second. It's nice in here, it's spacious. More, a lot more than the second one. Got a lot of cool stuff going on, I like it, I like it. Oh man, there's like, it's like a lighthouse. It's got, it's got like a lighthouse kind of aesthetic, I don't, I don't know what you'd call this. I mean, the, the, the game calls it, what is it, Nordic? Like Nordic, spru <coughs> Nordic spruce or whatever? I think so. Um, here's the where the builder lives. What does this say? Flat for let inquire at town hall. British in it. Um, oh, he needs a job. Well, I've got just the job for you, kid. Here's our builder. Should be see, the other bedroom yet, yeah, and then there's there's our Mason, not named Mason. Not named me. I mean, I guess that's what you get named from. You're just like, oh yeah, that's Mason. And it just kind of sticks with it. There is my cow and sheep pen. And I used to have pigs up until I built um, this thing right here. I say I. I don't mean I. I mean I told someone to build it because they don't give me building instructions. This is where my pigs live. Uh, the swine hen died like literally right before recording this. Um, so I will get that guy who's jobless and I'll just hire him. Oh, he's, he's got good stats. Abdullah. Abdullah. I like that name. That's a fun name. Um, there's the library over there. Um, it'll look really cool once it's level 5 because it's kind of like a castle. And that's kind of why I wanted it like on its own mountain. So it would be like, you know, you'd walk up to it and it'd, it'd be like a monument. It'd be very monumental. He's a good overlook of the town. Pretty, pretty good overlook. You get, you get like a good, um, get a good view of everything we've seen so far. Oh, okay. Here's the mine. I'll show that off later. Here is our, um, it's called our smeltery. That's what it's called. Uh, it smelts things. And then they get ores, I guess. But I only got it so I could get the. It's not next door. This is the school. It looks like it's part of the ghetto. But I, I did it so I could get the stone smeltery, which is one of the most useless things ever. Always begging for coal when you could make charcoal just as easily. And then I feel like they're never actually doing anything. Um, we'll get, get to even more stress in a minute. Um, there's one of my like five house entrances right here. Uh, there's the forester uh, who doesn't really cut down trees very well, very quickly. Either. It's probably because they're always using stone tools. I don't, I don't upgrade. I don't. I don't really know how to like renew diamonds. I mean, I I can myself, sure, but I don't know how to like do it for them. Lazy. Yeah, this is a uh, another residence. I think it looks nice. It's very colorful. Which I mean, it, it's kind of like very by. I don't know what I want to say. Like, I, I wanted to go for like a very like spruce feel, a very like spruce feel on the mountain, but ended up being a lot of like in can because it's very like doesn't consume a lot of space um, but it also looks kind of fucking ugly <laughs> I just kind of wish, wish there was a way how to like customize like the colors you could use but maybe there is and I'm just absolutely stupid but that's how it is all right we'll head down to the barracks right here it's the barracks got like a druid here I don't I've never seen this guy actually I don't know what he looks like. I don't know where he goes. He just kind of hangs out, I guess. Ooh, excuse me. A pretty good overlook. You can see the uh, more uh, urban area down there, which I'm working towards. I mean, I know that sounds kind of silly, but I'm working towards that. All right, here is. What? Are you kidding me? The um, what is it called? Plantation? Yeah. Where they grow sugar cane. Very cool, I know. Um, here's probably it's probably gonna end up being my favorite building because I think it looks really cool. It's the uh, Urban Birch Residence. Um, let's see, people live here. I know, crazy. People live in the residence. I'm pretty booked. People keep having kids. So, yeah. yeah I'll show the first floor. Why is there a, is that a furn a rail on a furnace? That's a, oh, is it supposed to be like a stove? Okay, that'd be that's that's neat. 
here is uh, a builder's hut. I built, I had this thing like built up to level five when I first requested it. <laughs> Good times. Just because I was like, yeah, might as well. You know, might as well speed up the building. Here's a composter's hut. Oh, he's a guard, okay. Here is my second barracks, level one. Only has like an archer. Yeah, that guy, Zayden. Here's the warehouse I built. Because I was having a lot of problems with my other warehouse just not working. Uh, so I figured that making more would be better. Um, and I hope it ends up looking as cool as I figure it will. Uh, it won't. I thought that... I spent like... Oh, shit. I spent like... Um, like five minutes, probably, at least, trying to figure out where they hid the freaking courier huts on this thing. Because they did it for the, um, the in-can one. And I didn't figure that out, because it was buried in snow until today when I upgraded it to level three. So I was like, oh, I must have done it for this one, but no, it's just the in-can one. So, uh, in-can is officially the best warehouse. Um, here is a little cave inlet, which is where that waterfall went you know it leads it straight down here but I wanted to build like a fisher's hut since there's not really like a, a body of water nearby like somewhere in here but I haven't figured it out yet because I'm lazy yeah there's stuff up here too behind the uh next to the uh, forest there there's the farm oh thrilling I know um my infinite water source aka the waterfall that leads from the mine to do a little inlet lake, which creates a little like um, waterfall, which goes. Hold on, there was. Well, use that. Which goes. Uh, there's a lake right here, an underground lake that used to be oil. Um, so I, you know, I just kind of swapped out all the oil and replaced it with water, cause why not? And then that goes down here through the plantation. I might get rid of like this dirt wall, just because um, goes down in there, and then it filters down into the underground lake, which I want to have be the fisherman at some point. So there's this area. In case you couldn't tell, I kind of like had to work with what I got, because I don't want to reuse. Even is this? Um, there's a new child. Okay. Epic. Um. Yeah, and then there's this. this. Barracks. I forget what style this is. Oh, it is in can. And it looks like shit. <laughs> I guess it's supposed to be, like, at the floor of the mountain. Because, like, yeah, that's what in can's supposed to be. I just kind of wish there was, like, a more mountainy mountain type thing. I don't know how to describe it. Like, a logical way. Um, and then this is the mechanics hut. I'm going to get that built at some point. I don't know when. Um... Let's see, what else is there? I uh, showed off the smeltery and the stone smeltery. There's the school. Which, I mean, I hope it'll look good when it's done, but... Um, um, well, I guess I'll show off the mine now. I need to make it look like a little more natural there. So, yeah, I'm probably going to like make this a bit more ca cavern-like. Just... Because it, it wasn't... It didn't look like this when I first got here. I'll say that. <laughs> Right, um, here's the mine, well, his house, well, his hut, he doesn't live here, he lives in the tavern because every other house is just, like, out of the way, I guess, because it's literally just, <laughs> it's literally just a walk up the stairs to the tavern, you know, you can't really get much better than that, um, and it goes all the way to bedrock, and he's probably whining about how he doesn't have torches, yeah, I don't have any charcoal, I, I'd, I'd give him charcoal, but... I don't have any. I'm teaching the charcoal recipe. Um, so we'll go down here. And then this is where I this is where I cut. People think I was walking down the ladder. All right, and um, this is the mine, or at least one of the shafts. I think the other one is that like why it's, it's, it's one a few levels down, but um, this one is this one's to the deep dark. At least part of it. I could fight the warden. I'll do that. That'll be fun. I'm sure people will enjoy that. Um, if I remember how to get there. 
I do like Skulk. I think it's pretty cool. Oh, here it is. Right this time. I was, I was close. Alright, um... Okay, I'll, um... F, I'll press F1 so you guys can see my uh, massive health bar. Actually, I even need the hearts, probably, because... I don't know any other ways to get, like, blue hearts. And I guess the Warden's pretty easy to, like... Wait, I thought I... Oh, there it is. Oops, okay, I'd be like... There we go. See, I with this bow, you'll see in a sec. When he oh, wait, I'm probably too far away, actually. If I'm not, then I should be like, boop. Come on, buddy. I want to, like, build down there. Is he? Yeah, he's like, there he is. He's still kind of like, he still makes me nervous. <laughs> Make you nervous, but yeah. Yeah, okay, come on, buddy. I hope the warden draws close. Okay. Wait, let me get my pickaxe out. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. <laughs> Alright. Like I'm scared of you. Where, oh yeah. Where is he? Get roaded. Do you drop? Let me drop the tire. Oh, we're doing it again, I guess. <laughs> Man, I love being an HP sponge. Man, what do you mean? Wait, didn't I pick up a blue heart? Oh, I got Okay, yeah. Oh, I threw it all in there, didn't I? I'll just be like, all right, get me out of here. I'm gonna find him again. And there we go. I like this. I like that teleport feature. Yep. All right, and then we cut, cut here, cut, cut here, Isaac. How many, how many like jokes am I gonna do? I just say cut. Okay. Um. Hold on. I gotta. All right, I'll just, I'll go down a few and be like, and be like, all right, and uh, back up to the surface. Uh, and it's nighttime. Woohoo! I love night. Uh, I already showed off the what is this? The smeltery. Right, there's that, and then there's the mine. Uh, need, needs a bit of work. I haven't really been paying a lot of attention to it lately. Probably even build like a house. It's probably somewhere over there. I think it look nice. Have like a little mining hut. I don't know. That's the problem. Is like everything's too big. There's nothing like small. There's like space wars. Sure, we're supposed to use that in like a, supposed to use that in like a, a desert, but I'm not moving to a desert. Also, I don't know if I mentioned this, but um, I moved here because there was a deep dark uh, here. Let me turn my. I think that's everything I built. Uh, I don't know, did I show this off? I built it the wrong way. I built this the wrong way, and I feel like an idiot. <laughs> uh, that's the story behind the mason's hut. Or whatever, or stone mason, whatever. Uh, I guess some more funny stories is, there used to be a, this is a, what is it, snowy slopes biome. Excuse you. This is a snowy slopes biome. Um, so there's a lot of powder snow, and these guys, those guys killed a lot of people in the early runs because I just didn't have anyone to protect them. Um, and so there's a lot of snowy slope. There's a lot of powder snow in this area. You can't, you, can't, you can't really see it right now. So people would like get caught in the powder snow and die. Um, and stuff. And I, I, every now and then I'll get like a message that says, 
Uh, a visitor has died. Yeah, here's one of the powder snow areas. Every now and then I get a message saying, um, uh, a, uh, a visitor has died because of powder or freeze or whatever. And it's like, rumors spread that your village is unsafe, and I got tired of hearing, I got tired of seeing that message. Uh, and so I just removed a bunch of powder snow. And yeah, you can kind of tell where the courier's huts used to be. It's kind of like general vicinity. So yeah, that's why I called it courier court, because like, I already knew what I wanted. Oh, I don't think I showed the um, university off. I didn't actually show off that either. I just kind of like pointed it out. Uh, but yeah, this is the uh, university currently. Uh, here's the research I have so far. Uh, if you care. Getting improved bows. And then I'm getting technology. And all that. Oh uh, yeah. Double trouble. What do I need? I need a level 3. Okay. Sorry. Still planning. Warehouse master. What is that? Sawmills. With oh shoot. Okay. Sorry. I know what I'm going to do next. <laughs> um, okay. And then. Yep. This is still the university. It's very big. Kind of annoys me. Uh, that's my problem with a lot of this stuff. Is that a lot of it's just too big. You know, it's like, yeah, bigger is better, so they say, but it kind of irritates me sometimes. <laughs> oh, yeah, that doesn't take you anywhere. These really are just like set pieces, though. I mean, you're not, you're not really like realistically gonna do anything, cause there's like, well, there used to be at least like beds and stuff in some of these rooms. Um, you know, but like you couldn't actually have people living here. But yeah, you couldn't actually have people like living there and stuff. So it's like, what's the point? It's, it's like it, they're just like glorified dollhouses. At least like you know, like a lot of these um, sorry, a lot of these restaurants. Some some I can't get these fucking people to work. I swear to God. So I, I I try my hardest to get these people to do, dear God, anything. But like half the time, it feels like I'm like herding cats and maybe um, I'll get like the guys behind mine colonies to like fix this shit make it like more user friendly yeah, this is the the nightmare that is the bakery you might you, you look in the inventory like, oh it's not that bad you got a stack but I mean like I don't know how to get them to make more bread because I want I've got I've got stuff I want to bake I've got you know I've got like toast I want to make and I want them to like make the bread two thousand years later like, I don't know if there's, like, an easy way to do that. But that's me airing my grievances about this. I'll show off my base. What? Okay, whatever. I'll show off my base. So here's the first initial entrance. Okay. Um, here is the glorious missing texture. Hopefully that'll be patched out one day. Here's a loom. Uh, here's two crates of golden apples because why not? Here's my jukebox, nothing in it. Only oh, like playing music. There's the glass ceiling. Uh, something that women can't smash, I guess. Uh, and then these are the shaders because I picked up God knows how many. And here is the factory. Well, the factory entrance where I do all the main stuff. It's the it's the prettier part where I get all the stuff, all the work done. You know, with all my C or all my whatever this stuff is called. You know, this is where I make, like, my enriched gold for, I'll show you in a minute. And then, you know, you put the, uh, whatever that's called. <laughs> and then it goes in there, and then it goes in the macerator. And then, um, you know, when I, this is, this is my jetpack refuel station. Uh, and then this is, put, like, the raw ores in here. Yeah, and then it goes all the way back through here. And then it gets pumped into, the true fucking died great. Are you kidding me? Alright, <clears throat> it gets pumped into here, um, and there's like there's like four or five different generators, included well, including like the solar panels, um, and yeah, the solar panels and the windmill up top. Tech, and then the yeah, and then there's um, there is a lava generator right here, um, the heat generator. It's got that passive heat. Um, I thought this looked cool, kind of matched, and so you wouldn't you'd probably just think it was a cool set piece. Uh, I think it was nice. I think it's neat. Um, so yeah, uh, and then yeah, I used cherry wood just because I I wanted to use a modded thing. It doesn't really it doesn't really have any like through line. Here's where I make steel because I got tired of doing 
a double metallurgic okay. Um this is fucking rude walking. I'm tired of looking at it. No, 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 no. Okay. Alright. Here's Michael. Yeah, this is where I keep a bunch of storage stuff. There's my Twilight Shader for his minecart. Michael's minecart and the, the banners right here. Uh, so then we'll move up to my fancy beacon. Because I've got a massive penis. Uh, my two blue skies portals. Um, and it's still, it's still a work in progress. Still like slowly but surely getting work done on it. Um, here's the second... Well, no, the third entrance I made. I'll show the second one just because it's right here. I thought this looked cool. Just kind of wanted to. I wanted to test some stuff out, and I figured I could use another entrance on the top. This is a much more finished part. So you look at this, and you're like, oh yeah, this looks pretty good. And here's a hallway that leads out to like the colony itself. There's my mining dimension portal, and I, th I think this. Um, I think this floor looks really nice. I, I wanted to do like like a see-through thing where you could just you'd get some lighting going on, and I've got like steel and like steel lamps or whatever they're called and yeah here you go to the first reactor the less powerful one really it's just a cyanide thing which is what these ceiling blue blue ceiling tiles are and here's my computer that gave me so much trouble it, you know, it just kind of like keeps it segregated that's yeah I like that I thought that'd be a nice trick uh, I, I like the reason there's gold here um, I just think it looks cool with the shaders on yeah this thing takes out 4,000 um, energy a tick and uh, that was this exists because I did math really bad. Just don't ask about it. There's a firefly on the reactor, a radioactive firefly. Um, and here is my reactor, blazing. It's cooled. Got that redstone. You know, we got all all that in the back. It's, it's basically the thing that powers this entire facility. Uh, and then I will I'll show you my garden my my beautiful gardens in just a moment just yeah I'd the force I had actually on here just throw, throw some of this in there and just so I want to make, I, I'm trying to keep up to date on with all these tiles just keep it because yeah. uh, here is my very wonderful urinite uh, farm you might call it excessive I wouldn't disagree I would not uh, mainly because uh, yeah well, you know, you know, if I need redstone, I got a redstone farm, if I need anything else. Um, but yeah, and then it just, it just lead, you know, leads back through here. Yeah, and then, yeah, there's that, that, which, this is the, the stuff you need to make, you know, this stuff. And I've, Lord knows I've got enough energized steel. I've made way too much. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is what I did with all that. I don't know how to say it. Creo, cre I don't. Dyslexia is a bitch. Um, so yeah, uh, and here's the kitchen. Uh oh. oh. There's no bottles in it, that's why. Yeah, we got, got two salty bees and a frosty bee for ice. So I get some salt, some ice. Um, it's a nice kitchen. It's nothing, nothing too fancy, and I got a chicken that lays eggs. I didn't want to like go too all out just because I didn't think I was gonna have to make food too much, but still ended up with a lot of cinnamon, a lot of wheat, a lot of wheat seeds. But you know that's that's just how it happens. I have like a billion apples just because I cut down a lot of trees. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a nice little thing, and I kept that in here because I kept losing track of time in here. Evidently, when you're a dwarf, you lose track of time. I wanted to make a bedroom. Um, but this ended up being like right below the, this ended up being right below the courier huts, which are now moved. So I might actually just do a bit, do a little bit more. But yeah, this thing. And then yeah, I wanted to use something fitting, so I used the uh, aluminum torches. I think I think the aluminum torches are nice. And I'm, I mean, I don't really have much <laughs> raw aluminum anymore. But um, yeah, so that's that's this village. There's I'll show off um, the the base as I called it. Who knows, maybe I'll show off Village Town too, just for the fuck of it. Okay, here's my nether uh, base.
<laughs> yeah, it's a party here. Look at these guys. Give, give me a fucking break. Yeah, this one, man. This prevents Willy Skeleton spawns. Or, well, for the most part, it does. They just end up suffocating and they can't really hit me. Yeah, it's really just a straight walk. I'll, I'll probably just cut this out. It's not really that interesting. Yeah, you see that guy who was suffocating. Yeah, there's a big old staircase down to the uh, to the base. Um, you just get down here. Oh, I didn't show off my factory. I just realized. But I'll show it off when I get back. This is where blazes exist, and that's how I got like two stacks of blaze rods and then some from a power react. My power reactor. Yeah, it's it's just enclosed. This is where the actual portal spawned in, so just kind of worked out well. Yeah, I was doing some bee stuff here, in, in case you couldn't tell. I was <laughs> sitting on my ass waiting for the bees. And here is Alpha Base, um, where I did all my stuff when I first got here. I found this. I was like, oh, this is a nice place. And then I moved here for a little bit. So I had to find the deep dark. So there's some stuff done. I've got um, skeleton bees and a few zombies. Cute pun. Um, there's wandering traders that live here now. My twilight forest portal. Just because I didn't really bumblebee spawn egg. Mushroom village map. That could be fun. So I don't have my emeralds on me. Or compass. Uh, so you can tell this is where a lot of my a lot of stuff still exists here. I just just don't really use it. Like I got a bunch of these fruit saplings that I don't use. There's still some like chests fruit full of stuff. Oh, I guess I do have a compass. All of my totem. Oh, a name tag. I want that. I don't really understand what most of this stuff is, and I'm, I'm not too good with. I'm not too good with going on Google and looking up things. I only did it for power because, well, power and big reactors because I literally had to. Like I mean, if I wanted to get a computer, right, my computer running because that that. Power reactor, the one with all the uranite, uh, exists. It existed initially solely to power only that computer, but I needed more juice on it, so then I just kind of give it some more lustrous nitrate. Is that? I don't think I have that back at base. I could be wrong though. And then I got did some fishing. I was looking for some puffer fish. I'll show you why in a minute. Yeah, so I got a few Neptune bounties. I think the chest looks nice, and I also got these. Neptune pants, and I got a Neptune uh, a, a shovel. Uh, and then, yeah, here's my altar where I make seeds every now and then. And here was a very primitive uh, farm for all these. And then I had to make, what was it, nature, the nature conglomerate or whatever. And you could tell I was doing some farming here, yeah. No shame in that. And, yeah, the. Yeah. Yeah, this is where I, this is where I fish when I feel like fishing. Which is never, but only when I have to. And here was my initial house. I think it looks nice. I, I like it. It's, it's very, it's very like, I don't know what, what you want to say, but it, it looks nice. I, as I think it does. There used to be like some factory stuff here. They, they were, a bee got stuck here, so I broke the window. Uh, but then I got tired of the window being broken, and I didn't feel like using any of my actual glass panes on it. Uh, this is where. A very primitive storage was before I ended up migrating. Uh, and here's my enchanting room, which I'm probably gonna end up migrating. I I I like this house, but you know I get I figure what do I get? I get like level like 80 enchantments or whatever. Yeah, I get like level 80 enchantments. Actually, I'll do that. So I get level 80 enchantments. I got oh yeah, what do I got? Yeah, 40, 60, 65.25. So yeah. The reason I took the, the long way, the, the scenic route, if you will, is just so I could warp back immediately. I just want to show off my nether base. I thought I'd start with the, the, the creeper party. Just takes you back here. There was a time where <laughs> uh, one of the uh, visitors wandered on the plate um, and he got teleported there and he was just stuck there for a little bit. I don't know why or how but yeah okay, I don't know if I showed this off but here is like the actual factory this is where my redstone gets made this is where my bone meal gets made good lord yeah we're good yeah. oh shit no yeah I got that point in there yeah, okay. and the 
this is where my uh, Supremium blocks get made. So I've got two of this. Oh shit, that's not right. Uh, there used to be like a seed processor here, but I moved it up top because it was significantly more useful up there. Because I like, <laughs> I've got like seven of those things, and then this is just where my generic goes. Right now, it's doing netherite, uh, just because I need netherite for um, uh, productive bees in the near future. And yeah, that's just about everything so far. Probably do another one of these uh, epic base tours at some point. Um, but for now, uh, that's it. Well, I want to end off on like a bang. I want to just like end out in a whimper. We'll go up, we'll go up here, I guess. Actually, no, we'll go with the campfire. All right. Um, and so yeah, that's my village as of this point so if you want to if you want to play this with me uh hit me up hit me up uh, you, what time is it? it's like eight <laughs> i'm yawning at 8 p.m it's over it's over it's over chat that's it cut